Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Thanks for joining me today on this 15th day of February 2023. All right, we're going to have voting video number 403 today, and it's going to have to do with Taco Bell sauce. Now, this is crazy for me, just like most of the ones I cover, because I usually don't cover Mandel effect changes unless, you know, I'm affected by them. So stay tuned to the end of this video for a few updates for the channel. Uh, I have some information. So let's get into this one here. You're going to comment down below if you remember Taco Bell medium sauce. Put the year that you remember eating it and then just put medium and put where you're from because the people that are arguing saying, oh, well, you know, you're, it was just a regional thing or, or you're thinking of Del Taco and, you know, all the, all, the, all the usual information that we get back from people when they find out that, you know, we're talking about this type of stuff. So here's the sauces. I remember this when I was real young. Uh, I remember these. This would be like 70s, 80s, 90s, you know, just guessing for me. But the problem is, I remember back in the 90s, my favorite flavor, none of them, even hot, nothing was really spicy for me. It was just my favorite flavor was the medium sauce. They had mild, medium, and hot before they came out with the fire and the Diablo. Um, in my memory, I remember them coming out with fire and then the medium went away. So apparently... Apparently, medium has never existed in packets in this reality. Now, the funny thing is you can buy a jar of medium. So that's really odd. They do have medium sauce, but it was never in a packet. Now, I remember mild having this color, medium having orange, and then red being the hot. I remember three different flavors. There were three options, and medium was my favorite flavor. So here it is here. You know, I, sh I should buy this and see if it, I never had it in a jar, so I should buy this jar and taste it and see if it rings a bell. Oh, no pun intended. <laughs> so uh, crazy, crazy Mandel effect for me. And I'm wondering who else had experienced. So there's people talking about it on Reddit. Uh, most of the people, there's not much information at all. There's nothing on YouTube. There's nothing on newspapers.com that I could find. There's just some Reddit posts starting in 2018. And then someone just talked about it. This is where I saw it on the 10th. So, you know, five days ago, I just became aware of this and I've been shaking my head for five days. So here you have, you know, medium was replaced by fire around 1994. That's kind of my memory. And this person says, you're thinking of Del Taco. <laughs> no, I'm not. Dude. I didn't even eat there when I was a kid. So, you know, oh my gosh. Anyway, <laughs> uh, so then you have other people here saying, same here, never even heard of Del Taco. Uh, you know, it, just like the Monopoly man with the monocle. Oh, you're thinking of Mr. Peanut. Well, people over in England, they don't know Mr. Peanut advertising. So, you know, those types of those types of suggestions of of what you know, a simple like uh, Occam's razor type, you know, suggestion. You know, the simplest explanation is probably what's what's happening. Well, no, it doesn't work with the Mandel effect. So, the Mandel effect is an incredible phenomenon that's just continuing to blow people. It's expanding. You know, I was doing some research and it looks like 1.5 billion hits on TikTok. And I'm guessing it's over a billion on YouTube. So we're talking two and a half billion times the Mandela effects been looked at. I mean, it's continuing to grow. So please vote down below. I'm no longer doing the thumb up, thumb down. You know, it doesn't work very good since they took down the thumb down count. We can't see the count. So Vote down below, just put medium, put the year you remember eating it, and put where you're from. Because, you know, people are saying, oh, that's just a regional thing. Well, in Northern California, I remember medium was my favorite flavored sauce. So to me, this is a Mandel effect. I wanted to talk real quick about the Mandel effect phenomenon factor fiction. You know, I've interviewed Robert Kiviet a few times, uh, probably about four times on the channel, and we should be having him on soon for another update. The the documentary film is still moving forward. You know, things have just taken a little bit longer than, than Bob had thought, but everything's moving forward. Things are seeming like they're going to be kicking off and getting exciting. So I'm excited for that. Before I go, I wanted to talk about the short videos I've been putting out. I'm putting out a lot of shorts and they're not really for the subscribers. They're for new people. I'm getting two, three, sometimes 10,000 views on the shorts and almost none of them, only a few hundred are my subscribers. So they're being put, in, put into a shorts feed, 
and they're being thrown into where you know people are swiping up, swiping up, and they're just being thrown in there. Like within the first few hours, usually I get three thousand people see the video. I, it's never that way with my regular long form like this. So those are for new people. I'm getting a lot of hundreds and hundreds of new subs. The f- channel's finally growing. So those of you criticizing the shorts, well, I'm sorry, but they're not for you. You know, they're to help grow the channel, to help do what I've been doing for seven years is create awareness for this incredible phenomenon. So that's what they're for. And uh, that's about it, everyone. Uh, Please comment down below. Tell me what your memory is. I'll be back with everyone soon. Uh, Probably in the next so many days, uh, we'll get an update from Bob on the upcoming documentary. Very exciting. That's about it. I'll talk to everyone soon. Go create the reality that you want.